One of the most notable differences right now be between the Democratic and Republican parties outside of ideology is that the Republican Party not only isn't ashamed to nominate and elect people who just can't think, whose brains really don't work, they almost seem proud of it in some strange way. And one such person is radical Republican Congresswoman from Georgia, Marjorie Taylor Greene, fresh off the primary win that she had last week, who now has gaffed again using the term peach tree dish rather than Petri dish. Now we'll get to that. And when I say she's gaffed again, I'll remind you at one point uh, trying to talk about some kind of covid Gestapo using the term gazpacho, which is, of course, a cold Spanish tomato soup sometimes with a cucumber in it, which I think is a nice thing to add to gazpacho. OK, take a listen to this. Not only do we have the D.C. jail, which is the D.C. gulag, but now we have Nancy Pelosi's gazpacho police spying on members of Congress. Now, some people speculated she does this on purpose to get attention. No, she doesn't. There is absolutely no evidence whatsoever that she has any idea about the word gazpacho versus Gestapo. It, it there is absolutely no reason to think that. Well, she's done it again. And this time she's talking about uh, fake meats and she seems to think that fake meat is grown not in a Petri dish, which is, of course, you know, a little uh, plastic uh, <laughs> container for uh, holding cells, bacteria, whatever um, that it is a peach tree dish. It's a dish in which you put a tree that grows peaches. You have to accept the fact that the government totally wants to s provide surveillance on every part of your life. They want to know when you're eating. They want to know if you're eating a cheeseburger, which is very bad because Bill Gates wants you to eat his fake meat that grows in a peach tree dish. A peach tree dish. So you'll probably get a little zap inside your body and that's saying, no, no, don't eat a real cheeseburger. You need to f eat the fake, the fake burger, the fake meat from Bill Gates. Um OK. So it's just a gaffe, right? I mean, who cares? Well, it's actually much bigger than just any individual gaffe. These people can barely put together a coherent thought and it doesn't matter. We have a political party. Uh, we have a pol members of a political party in this country that don't care about the fact that their candidates can't think they can't think and they still vote for them. In normal countries, these folks would not stand a chance at being in positions of power. And they'll come back and say, oh, how elitist, David. You think only people who use real words and can speak and think a little bit should be able to be in a well, I'm not saying it should be illegal for them to run. What I'm saying is that a sane country would never vote for these people. Look at what's going on with Herschel Walker in the Senate. I we played these clips last week, but I'll include them here because they're relevant. Herschel Walker is endorsed by Trump, former football player, won his Senate primary in Georgia, essentially unopposed. He can't speak. He can't think. OK, here he was asked by CNN reporter Manu Raju whether there should be any new gun laws. And his answer was what I like to do is see it in everything and stuff. That that's the whole answer. Hey, Juan Raju with CNN. I know. I know. I know. Guys, are you, do you support any new gun laws in the wake of this Texas shooting? Do, what now? do you support new gun laws in the wake well, of this Texas shooting? What I like shooting? to do, what I like to do is see it and, uh, and everything and stuff. I like to see it. You know. He likes to see it and everything and stuff. Then uh, the next day he appeared on Fox News and he said he would solve school shootings with a department that can look at young men, looking at young women, looking at social media. That's the solution. See, that is a person willing that weapon, you know, Cain, Kia, Abel, you know, and, uh, you know, and that's the problem that we have. And I said, what we need to do is look into how we can stop those things. You know, he talked about doing a disinformation. What about getting a department that can look at young men that's looking at uh, women that are looking at uh, just social media? What about doing that, looking into things like okay. that? So that's his idea. I, we want to get a department that can look at young men, looking at women, looking at social media. They cannot speak. They cannot think. And it doesn't dissuade Republicans. It doesn't dissuade Republicans. And so the question becomes, how can you defeat a movement whose elected officials don't even have to have a functioning brain 
And that doesn't even dissuade the voters. It doesn't seem like reality matters anymore. And so how do you defeat that? I guess voter turnout on our side. But uh, I mean, listen, that you we say that every year and then there's always like so so voter turnout, particularly in midterm. So I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. One of our sponsors is Curiosity Stream, the only subscription streaming service that specializes in documentaries. My audience can get a Curiosity Stream subscription for only about a dollar a month at curiositystream.com slash Pacman. We all know Netflix than Hulu. They have some documentaries, but Curiosity Stream has a way better selection in every category. I'm always finding documentaries on Curiosity Stream I can't find anywhere else. I just watched Electing Lincoln, which is a three part series about what led to the election of Abraham Lincoln. Fascinating, absolutely fascinating. Curiosity Stream has an app for all of your devices. I've always got it going on the TV or I can do put it on my tablet when I travel with Curiosity Stream. I can explore a new topic I never knew I'd be interested in or zone out with a great nature documentary. Whatever you're looking for, it's there and you can get Curiosity Stream for just fourteen ninety nine a year. That's less than two bucks a month when you go to curiositystream.com slash Pacman and use the code Pacman. The link is down below.